Okay, guys, so if you didn't know, I was actually a PES E clerk back in NS. So during BMT, I was like with all the other PES E's. Like, because back then, uh, it wasn't PES E and PES E combined, it was just PES E BMT. So, like back then, uh, I tell you, PES E got a lot of um, interesting people, uh, basically, that's what I would say. So, that, there was this particular guy, uh, he's like a bit weird, and his freaking 40 number is right after me, so he sits next to me, no? So this guy is uh, really a bit weird lah. Like um, he told us like his medical condition is called he's a, he's a psychopath. Like that's his medical diagnosed condition and that's why he's in army lah. So I'm gonna tell you guys what happened to me about how I almost like got like stabbed by him lah. Like stabbed lah. But yeah. So anyway like some of the weird things he did lah. He was like doing very weird things. Like he was like smoking at the playground or something like in public. Not at the smoking area. Then burning himself in the middle of the day during camp. And then he was like talking a lot of weird and funny things lah. So whenever I was around him, I'm like super cautious, no. I like don't know what he's gonna do, no. He asked me a lot of weird things like, bro, do you like burn yourself at night or, or whatever thing lah. So like one day, right, in the lecture theater when we were having our lectures, he was seated next to me. He's always seated next to me, that's the thing. So he was like playing with his pen, no. Like his pen, like, like, like playing the pen. Yeah, so he was doing this, like playing the pen, playing the pen, yeah, like, doing lecture, no. Then he came over and whispered to me, Bro, do you think if I stab you with this pen, pain or not, bro? Bro, well, then at that moment, I like, Wow, oh, this guy is sort lady. Then I like, Yeah, pain, bro, pain. Then I, I legit like, at that point, I was like, Really, oh, I die, confirm. Uh. He do anything funny, I ain't gonna like shove him or something, no. But then at that time, I walk off, la, like, I pussy, la. then I just walk off. I didn't go toilet or something. And then I came back, and then like, the lecture was over, so we F off. Yeah, so anyway, I managed to avoid getting stabbed by this guy. But he was dead ass about to stab me, I swear to God. I don't even know what was going on. And a lot of other weird things he did. But then, after that, right? Like, in the next couple of days after that incident. I mean, I didn't complain or anything. But he got freaking down pass, no guys. Basically, he got kicked out of the army. And didn't have to serve NS. He was down pass to pass F. Which basically means exempted from NS lah. So yeah. Passy stories, guys.